Not too long ago, I met one of the most remarkable kids. Jonah Larson is a 12-year-old crochet prodigy whose creations are going viral. He's also authored two books. Now it's your turn to meet the one, the only, the amazing Jonah in today's DBL Spotlight. Welcome, Jonah Larson, to Daily Blast Live. First off, as we're talking, you're crocheting. I'm doing a little cross stitch. Can you tell me what you're working on right now? Right now, I'm working on a really chunky cowl with the single crochet herringbone basket weave stitch. It makes it nice and thick and perfect for the frigid Wisconsin winters. Oh my God, are you like 102? You're so mature, that's amazing. Tell me how you started crocheting. Yeah, it was really a fluke, but it was a wonderful one. It was like a happy accident. I was five years old and I was start by saying my aunt was a crafter. She sewed, she cross-stitched too. And one day she was cleaning out her basement after she had some craft supplies that she no longer needed. And she brought them over for me. So my mom went on YouTube because you can learn anything from YouTube these days found a tutorial on how to make a dishcloth with crochet and I sat down at our table for about an hour and they had a pretty well made dishcloth at five years old and I'm so proud because I still have it and use it today. Bravo, bravo. Why do you think you love it so much? Well, there's a plethora of reasons I love crochet so much. Of course, for starters, it's really amazing being able to see a ball of yarn turn into a project with just a hook yes. and then your hands. And it's also, it's so wonderful and a great way to calm down. And it's very relaxing. As you probably know, if you're cross-stitching, you really enjoy to do it after a hard day. It, like the repetitive motion is so calming, almost like therapy in a way. You are such a remarkable kid for so many reasons. But one is you wrote a book and you even started a library. What? Tell me about that. Well, I'll start by showing you both of my books, because I have two. Here's the first uh -huh. one. It's Hello Crochet nice. Friends. It's about my autobiography and how I started to learn how to crochet and kind of recounting my story. And the second one, oh. it's a book of patterns called Giving Back Crochet. And they're just simple patterns, like a nice scarf, a hat, a blanket, some baskets that you can make and give to people in need and really have such that nice sense of accomplishment by helping others. All right, let me ask you a question. You already seem super grown up, but what do you want to be when you grow up? If you could be anything in the world, what would you be? As of now, when I grow up, I want to be a surgeon because I think the crochet helps my hand dexterity. And of course, when you're a surgeon, you're saving people's lives. So it just seemed like all the good things in a category. I feel like you would do surgery on someone and then knit them or crochet them like their gown. And what I would do is I would do their surgery and then send them out the door with a crocheted hat. Yeah, like you're unbelievable. All right, so let me see your crochet from what you've done. Let me show show the camera. And it got a whole lot longer. Nice! All right, I'll show you mine. I'm making a Marvel comic book uh, sampler for someone to learn how to read using Marvel characters. And these are all superheroes, but to be honest, you're my superhero, Jonah. Thank you very much. That means a lot because superheroes, they're, they're like the Marvel superheroes, and then there's just everyday people doing great things like so many others out there. You're, you should really be thinking about taking my job. Call my agent, call my manager. You are better at this than I. Thank you so much. We so appreciate it.